Our population that we serve is quite diverse. We see babies the second they come out of mom to patients that are over 100 or dying through hospice. I think we have a lot of great learning opportunities that give us time to work with different specialties, other therapies and vocations, as well as case managers and social workers. And the patient population that we serve is mainly underserved. Um, basically in downtown area, we have a lot of people. We have from like homeless population, from just low income population, no insurance. But then we also have um, young professionals around the area as well. So, we, so we'll have some of those patients in our clinic as well. Um, but mainly it's just like the lower income. So we make sure that we provide for them in, in terms of like their health, but then also in terms of any social needs that they have. So we have a social worker here. Um, and the choice program, which focuses on mental health. So we try to um, just approach their health in different ways, especially when they are able to actually get here so that we can take care of all of those things because of the needs that they have outside of here, so. The patient population that we serve is very inner city. Our clinic is right downtown Indianapolis, directly attached to Methodist Hospital. So we see a lot of inner city patients. Um, we also see a few university patients. Um, from time to time, we do rotations outside of the city and the surrounding area. Some of the outpatient exposure we get is in a OB clinic that serves predominantly a Burmese population. Um, so you get a, a lot of different experience here. So at this clinic, we um, serve a very medically underserved population. So that means we see a lot of chronic diseases from a typical bread and butter, like high blood pressure, diabetes. And usually it's at its advanced stages as these persons are unable to get help sooner. We also have a lot of off-site clinics we go to, such as the Winrose, which is one of the FQHC qualified health centers. Um, and we see a lot of pregnant patients over there from the Burmese population. So it's a very diverse group of patients we're able to see here. And I think it really trains you and prepare you for the world out there uh, as you get a good mix of pathology and you got to build a rapport with different patients, different cultures, and it's very, very beneficial to your clinical knowledge.